A church exists for the people who are not yet a part of it. We have an opportunity to be future focused. What we're going to be able to do for our community and beyond is really more than we can ever hope or imagine. The future of St. Michael is really bright. And by developing the asset of our North land, we're going to be able to grow into the church that we really hope to be in the future. St. Michael's presents this planned development, encapsulating both our dreams as a church and the desires of our neighborhood. This plan checks every one of the task force recommendations. We want to bring in a ground floor restaurant, provide for generous and welcoming open spaces, and provide a dedicated space for our farmer's market. The parking will be used by the building during the week and by the church congregation on weekends and evenings. And with ESD leaving, we will be taking the carpool off the streets and easing traffic. We have agreed to partner with Lincoln Property Company, who will lease the property to our north and build two mid-rise buildings, a residential building and a commercial building. We will continue to own the property. Lincoln Property will pay us rent as the tenant. At the same time, the income stream allows us to grow our ability to do good in the city and beyond. What excites me about this project is that for the first time, we'll be able to go out of our north doors, out toward the north of our property into green space. We're gonna be able to use that green space, not only for us, but for the entire community, welcoming people onto our campus in a way that we really can't at this point. And that's going to make this whole campus more active and energetic and welcoming to everyone in our neighborhood. Being a part of St. Michael is really one of the joys of my life. I love the community that we have here and the sense of purpose in our congregation. I've met so many great people here who really think deeply about the kinds of lives that they want to live and how we can better serve others. The leaders of this church want to make those dreams become a reality. And that's the reason why I support this project. By making this strategic move, by using our assets to the north of our property, we're going to be able to move confidently into the future that allows us to make number one, the people who are not here yet. Jesus' parable of the talents teaches us that God wants us to maximize what we've been given, to use our gifts as best we can. We now have a unique opportunity to allow us to continue to grow our ministry and mission in this city and beyond.